Aqua Innova team has the business plan to enter major shrimp farming market in China and Asia. What is it that makes this market strong for investment? So at, at that moment, Thailand is the biggest ch uh, shrimp mm, exporter. Is that yes, correct? Yes. And then the number two exporter? Um, well, consider about the production. Mm. China will be the number one uh, shrimp production, but uh -huh. they um, consume domestically. More. But more mm. than Thailand. But um, uh. for export, China will be number two. I see. And, uh, but uh, your export markets uh, will be initially Vietnam and Indonesia. And oh. next is Vietnam and Indonesia. Yes, for mm. this device, we uh, just mm. go for a country that cultivates shrimp. And mm. these four countries account for more than 80% uh, uh, of the yes. global The global supply. Export. You mean Thailand, China, Vietnam, and Indonesia. Indonesia. Yes. So all together produce 80% of the world's uh, global supply. So farm yes. mm. cultivated shrimps, yes. right? The remaining will be um, South America, mm -hmm. also uh, Medi um, Middle America as well. Mm. Can you, can you uh, briefly, this uh, shrimps, uh, when they are very small, there are baby shrimps that are vulnerable to diseases? Uh, mm. Yes, the brood stock. Um, uh -huh. well, actually, what are the major diseases, please? Um, the major disease that constantly uh, found mm. is uh, they call white spot syndrome virus, or WSSV. White spot. Uh -huh. Yes. And um, then? Like the mortality can occur within three days, and also uh -huh. um, mostly they found a Taurus syndrome virus and yellowhead mm -hmm. virus. Mm -hmm. And these are the three major mm -hmm. viruses that cause the mm -hmm. shrimps to So, and you said if they get infected, they will be killed in three days. Uh, yeah, but, uh, mostly uh, we concentrate on white spot syndrome virus. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Yes, but the problem is that it can spread really fast because mm -hmm. these viruses are airborne and waterborne and can easily contact mm -hmm. by the carrier. Mm -hmm. So, quite and. You, how you do the testing, briefly? Well, testing is you take the part of the shrimp samples, yes. you grind it, and then mm. mix with uh, our reagents, mm. and then incubate with uh, um, our device. Put and in our device, and mm. wait until uh, 45 minutes, you can get a result, result. in the monitor screen. Monitor screen. Mm. Yes. And if the result is the positive, then what do the farmers do? Well, um, if they show that the virus is present, then uh -huh. they will follow by the effective containment process mm -hmm. by um, emergency um, harvesting. Uh -huh. If the shrimp size is small, they can eliminate it. Uh -huh. For the larger size, they can choose to um, sell domestically. Hmm. Before the schedule? Uh, yes. 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 So, no. so this one is like a damage containment yes. device. Yes. So the farmers detect the diseases early in the production stage, then they can contain the yes. damage. Mm -hmm. Some even compare as an insurance <laughs> program for the shrimp. Uh -huh. So just to make sure that um, your shrimp will be safe mm -hmm. enough. Or so your product will help boost the competitive competitiveness of Thai shrimp farmers? Yes, uh, yes. reduce the, the loss of Thailand shrimp farm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, 97 percent accurate, right? you said. Yes. Uh, what about the capital investment in your business plan? Who are going to invest to produce the, these uh, devices? Um, that, that's the main uh, part why we attend several competitions because there are so many potential uh -huh. investors. Um, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Because we go on roadshow and we make um, kind of um, exhibition on that. Mm -hmm. So we have been in contact mostly um, Singapore investor. Mm -hmm. Yes, but we are still on negotiation mm -hmm. process. Uh, any Thai companies that are interested in your product? Um, so far, uh, Bangkok Bank. <laughs> no, uh, Bangkok Bank, they like to other. finance. And one, one, and mm. one uh, yes. individual also interested. One individual. So yes. How much money will be needed in the first uh, stage well, of investment? Um, as our projections go, 500,000 500, US dollars. dollars. Mm. But which, this is flexible. Which is the how many million baht? <laughs> <laughs> 15 million yes, baht. Yes. Yes. And this money yes. will be needed for, for what? In uh, for our working capital, for yes. our ongoing ND. Marketing and sale. Mm. Yes. Uh -huh. uh, and field ID, testing. Marketing field and sale. testing, mm -hmm. marketing and sales. Yes. So your team, four of you, will set up a company to do this? Or how are you going to proceed with your business plan? Uh, yes, we will set up the company and also including inventors as well. Mm. So we're still um, right now on the, um, uh -huh. considering how the, the form of the company will be. Mm. Yes. And uh, you, both of you already uh, graduated from Sassin? Yes. yes. So this is going to be your business after the graduation? Uh, we are looking forward to it. Uh -huh. What is the sales target uh, according to your business <laughs> plan? Well, um, we make a five years projection uh -huh. and um, basically uh, within five years we want to reach to the China market and we mm. expect that the net sales will be around uh, 25 million US dollars. 25 million US yes. dollars. But, um, there's yes. like, um, it, when you compete in business plan, there's like some sense that you, you have to mm. do uh, and Over the next five years, yes. right? Yes. How are you going to do that, achieve that target? 
um, uh, according to our marketing strategy and also build a reputation. Mm. Mm -hmm. And then uh, starting with in Thailand first and then later uh, on in neighboring markets like yes, Vietnam, Vietnam and Indonesia. Indonesia. Yes, and also uh, we gain so many contacts from the competition. Uh -huh. so, so we hope that uh, the network creation can also help us to access mm. to different country. Mm. Mm. And well. after, after the ASEAN market, then you look forward to tapping the Chinese China market. Uh, yes. China is mm -hmm. in so that one will be the they are the biggest producer right yes. of chimp farms yes. except that the domestic consumption is mm -hmm. quite large yes. so Thailand is the biggest exporter yes. net exporter yes then and you said that uh, Singaporean investor are keen in this so you are ready to join hands with them um, well, actually, because we we won the the competition and uh -huh. they grant us some uh, amount of investment, and also, uh -huh. but the, there's like some condition that you have to register mm. your company in Singapore, so uh -huh. we have to consider about that. Mm. Mm. What what about the patents? Who own the patents of this? Oh, well, uh, it belongs to an STDA Thailand for mm. battery agents and also uh, for the device. I see. That's a national science and technology yes. agency. I see. Government and how you pay the loyalties to the inventors? <laughs> well, we have the exclusivity. Uh, uh -huh. we, ha we have made the negotiation on what we have to pay up front mm -hmm. and also mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. how many percent. But mm -hmm. it will be yeah. remained secretly. <laughs> but you have to say a little bit on why your device is more competitive than the con other equipment that okay, already in the um, market. Conventionally, um, they use yes. a two methods, mm -hmm. or they call the PCR. Well, uh -huh. PCR is. Um, mostly to diagnose most of the virus, um, mm -hmm. the, the diseases. But mm -hmm. it can only be performed, like yeah. it has to be in a well, a construct environment, such as yes. a laboratory. And uh -huh. also, the, the, like, the more high sensitivity, the more expensive it can get. Mm -hmm. And uh, you require a highly trained and with a degree technician to operate it. Mm -hmm. So I think our in inventors see this uh, problem, and they just want to um, reduce you know, the, the, the complication of mm -hmm. the uh, testing process. You mean the average shrimp farmer in Thailand can use this device uh, yes. without any technical knowledge? Um, we make it simple enough. That's why uh, the uh -huh. reagent is the pre premix of several um, And we can reagents. train them. Mm -hmm. It's easy to, to yeah, train. Reduce the rate of contamination and mm -hmm. um, give them more accuracy in the results as well. Mm. And when compared to the earlier inventions, uh, it's more difficult to use. Uh, it's more mm -hmm. difficult to use, but mm -hmm. uh, our product, we also need to develop a um, specific reagent for each disease, mm -hmm. and that's why we need an ongoing R&D. And mm -hmm. traditional method is cost higher than our product, mm -hmm. and uh -huh. the machine, the cost of machine, the farmer cannot afford the cost Mostly. of machine. Yes. So it's cheaper, your device? Yes, yes. because it's local, local, local machine made, made mm -hmm. by yes. Thai. Mm -hmm. So when you went to Singapore for this uh, startup, startup mm -hmm. at Singapore competition, mm -hmm. Who were your major rivals? I mean, what kind of businessman? Which uh, uh, MBA school? Which? Um, and I think it's NUS. Uh, <laughs> the National U University <laughs> of Singapore, Singapore yes. which is one of the best uh, schools in this in yes. uh, region. Yes. And uh, I think there are a vast array of uh, business plan attending. Mm -hmm. They even have some program of um, CSR mm -hmm. and uh, some of. Uh, renewable energy, uh -huh. IT, IT. IT uh, website, social network and stuff. So it's pretty competitive though. Mm. So it, it's hard for us to compare because uh, we just specifically on the shrimp market. Mm. So for some people, they think we're just a bit too specific. Mm. But um, it uh, can be the platform for other mm -hmm. virus detection device, but this is mm. just only the beginning mm. of our products. Yes. Mm. You mean the Singaporean student, they did not have this kind of products? to compete with you? Um, I think uh, some are just uh, the rough idea, scratching. Uh -huh. But um, I think uh, it depends on how ready you are to launch the business. So, mm. I mean, I... Credible of our the product and of the our products. team. But uh, mm. I think we, we earn a lot of good experience and we think there mm. are so many good ideas. Uh, I see. So can, can you tell other students in Thailand uh, on why Thai students could actually be very competitive uh, overseas? <laughs> I think uh, we are hardworking yes. people, uh -huh. and uh, also we um, do it um, completely. I think we look at different aspects, and also um, mm -hmm. we build a strong teamwork. Uh, mm -hmm. After competing several competitions, again, I think some of the team, like in the United States, they come mm -hmm. with two or three people. Mm -hmm. So it's quite a 
amount of workload. Mm. But uh, for, for us, I think we have people with different backgrounds, so mm. they have lots of experience to come and share. Mm. And we spend mostly long time, long term mm. on this project, longer than what we heard from other team. Mm. What um, and actually, I think that the inventor in Thailand is uh, the one of, I, I think it's the, the they have knowledge enough, in, enough to create the new thing and interesting, interesting thing for global, but they, mm. they lack of some, uh, some knowledge for management. So if we can, can join the management knowledge with the uh, uh, other knowledge, such as bio yes. or engineering knowledge, we can make it to be the real business. Yeah. I mean that if we can uh, make the best plan for mm. the best product, we can mm. succeed in, in the business. And that's why we, we take it seriously than other okay. people. Yeah. So hard work and yeah, serious. Yes. Yes. So thank you both of you for joining our program. Thank you so much. Follow Towards 2015 open up to the ASEAN market every Wednesday and Thursday from 10.30 to 11 p.m. on ASEAN TV. And also follow us online via Facebook only on ASEAN TV.